I'm a FINA Bureau member from the Netherlands. I'm involved in water polo during my life. I've been president of the Dutch Federation for 16 years with all the disciplines. I'm still playing water polo. And what I'm doing here, giving a speech, but also being a moderator to help the water polo family to find the right answers on the questions. You know, water polo is a wonderful sport and we playing water polo, we love it. But we don't see what other people in the world see. And that's today the, the item. How are other people thinking about our sport? And if you are standing still, you are leaning backwards. So finding the answers for the future means reflecting, reflection on our sport, thinking what is good but what could be better, and to make the, team, the, the game more attractive, uh, whereas it has become a little bit static through the years. We don't notice ourselves, but other people tell us. And to be part of the IOC family, it's not only important to be dynamic, but also to involve as many federations as possible. So we want to spread water polo around the world. Well, one of the highlights for me personally is the gold medal of the Dutch women 2008 Beijing. I was there, I have seen the preparations. I saw them winning the, uh, the qualification tournament in Russia. I was there myself. Uh, that's, that's one, but the, the second one I want to mention in the light of this conference, last year here in Budapest, the, the Japanese men played USA team and the Japanese have developed a new strategy in water polo playing. They were defending the USA men from behind instead of between the men and the, and the, and the goal. They were crawling behind the back of the USA men and the USA men didn't know how to react. So this was one of the signs that it's possible to renovate, to innovate our sport.